Okay, Colorado and Company friends, it's time for another fair guest. Jesse Ogus joins us now with a new game called Fair or Foul. Hey y'all, it's time for Friday's Faircast. I am Jesse Ogas and today I bring you our first game of Fair or Foul, starting with the Chafee County Fair, opening today in Salida. Play ball! Would it be fair to say that you can check out some of the oldest machines from the 19th and 20th centuries? Is that fair or foul? Fair! That's right. The Arkansas Valley flywheelers will be on display throughout the fair, showing off farm equipment, trucks, and tractors. You also won't want to miss the professional rodeo on Friday, August 1st, and Sunday, August 2nd. And also, the Junior Livestock Show will happen on August 1st. Play ball! So for our next fair or foul, the Albert County Fair opens this weekend. Now, it's been a tradition, but has it been a tradition for 50 years? Fair or foul? Foul, foul, that's foul. It's 80 years. Play ball! 4-H Youth are center stage, and you never have to leave if you don't want to. Why? Because camping is allowed. Is that fair or foul? That's fair. Now, the best part of the Albert County Fair is free parking and free admission. Don't miss the backseat driving contest, the horseshoe throwing contest, or the mini bareback riding. The Albert County Fair runs today through August the 2nd in Kiowa. Yeah! You'll need to wait a few days before enjoying cotton candy and fried Twinkies at the Fremont County Fair. It opens on July the 27th. If you're the best in the West at team roping, goat tying, and quilting, this fair is for you. One thing you won't want to miss is the fiddle contest and some of the best cotton candy and caramel apples you'll find. Now, who wants to see my cup stacking skills? Let's do this. That's some pretty foul cup stacking. If you can do better than me, then don't miss the Fremont County Fair, July 27th through August 2nd. History hits a home run in Burlington with the Kit Carson Rodeo and Fair. Ready for fair or foul? Play ball! Kit Carson County Carousel was quite a foul idea when it was first brought into town. But now, it's fair! The carousel will be open during the fair. It was built in 1905 for Elitch Gardens, but was sold to Kit Carson County for $1,200 in 1928. That didn't sit very well with some of the people in the town. They called it an extravagant expenditure because the county was experiencing hard times. It's been operating ever since and is absolutely a crowd favorite. You won't want to miss the rodeo, live animals, garden judging, and of course my favorite, the free barbecue and watermelon at the Kit Carson County Fair and Rodeo, July 27th through August the 1st. Also happening this weekend, the Montrose County Fair, July 24th through August 2nd. Rio Blanco Fair, July 24th through August 1st. Bent County Fair, July 25th through August 1st. And last but not least, the Montezuma County Fair, July 25th through August 2nd. Back to you, Denise. All right, thanks, Jesse. That was awesome. Next Wednesday, your chance to win big at the Adams County Fair. We have the ultimate fair experience prize package with carnival wristbands, free parking, and concert tickets to the Plain White Tees. That's next Wednesday morning, 10 a.m., right here on Colorado & Company.